What's going on nerds? Welcome back. My name is Sned. Since we finally have an elytra, we need some rockets to be able to fly, right? That means a lot of gunpowder, and that means a gunpowder farm. You've heard of a gunpowder farm before, right? The cats and the creepers and all the stupidness? Well, I present to you the rocket farm. Leave a like if you liked it, subscribe if you didn't, and please enjoy the episode. Welcome back everybody. So, I kind of hinted at it last episode, very, very briefly. If you caught it, props to you. But this episode, what I would like to do is build an automatic gunpowder farm. And I know, when you think of gunpowder farms, you think of a million creepers spawning and a bunch of cats there to scare them away and yada yada. Well, I plan on doing things a little differently. If you look up gunpowder in JEI and you left click on it, it tells you all of the different ways that you can make gunpowder. The best way that I think are burnt paper blocks. And they give you two. Burnt paper blocks are just simply paper blocks that you smelt down. And a paper block is just nine paper. So, everybody's seen an automatic sugarcane farm before, right? Right. Once the sugarcane grows, it's going to get filtered into an auto crafting table. From there, the paper is going to be made into paper blocks. And I'm going to try and section it off so that like half of them get burnt and half of them don't that way I still have paper for the firework itself but the paper blocks half of them will be sorted into uh, electric furni furnaces furni I don't know what the ruling is there but once they get burned all we have to do is put them into another auto crafting table and make them into gunpowder. It sounds like a very long and tedious process, and yes, it absolutely will be. But I think it will be worth it. My end goal here is to have a completely automatic firework rocket maker. It's gonna be a big factory, but we should never have to worry about fireworks ever again. So I was trying to think of ideas on how I wanted this, I don't know, this factory, I guess? How I wanted it to look? And I think it would be pretty sweet if it was in the shape of a rocket, because ultimately it will be creating us rockets, you know? So this is the start of the, the cone. And my idea is this is going to be the sugarcane farm, this little circle. And I'll have, you know, it'll be a normal sugarcane farm. And if, if you don't know what one of those looks like, oh shoot. Oh wait, I... If you don't know what a sugarcane farm looks like, you'll you'll have to wait until the end of the episode to see it. But from here, it's all just going to get pushed into one central area and then taken down to, I don't know, the next layer. And the next layer is going to be the body of the rocket. And I think that should be enough room for all of the machinery that we're going to need. And then on top of the cone, there's going to be some solar panels, and those are going to be what power everything, I think. And then after everything gets cycled down, if you could see, uh, I might need to take off my pants for this. If you could see the bottom of the rocket, how it has that little, I don't know, tail, the part that you light, you know, to blast off the rock, whatever. That is going to be a little bridge that kind of sloops down from here and comes up and it's gonna you know just give us access to the actual rocket I don't know I have I have a grand image uh, I don't know if it'll work but we're gonna find out so after doing some more tinkering I think I know where we're at so basically this concrete is 32 blocks high and I don't know if you could tell but it, it kind of goes down like right there I'll, sh I'll take you down there in a second and that is going to link up somewhere over there towards the bottom of that little, I don't know, this little outcrop of the island. This block is four blocks away. That is where the cone is going to be. And this is going to be the top of the body. So starting from here, looking up, it's going to be nothing but the cone slash sugarcane farm. And inside this little area here is going to be all of the machinery capable of processing the sugarcane into paper, into gunpowder, into paper blocks, that's out of order, whatever, you know what I mean. So I think, I think we are going to have enough space. I think this is scaled up to four times the size of our rocket. So we have a 20 and the image on the Minecraft wiki has it set as five across, five pixels across. So 
I, I feel like a four times scale is pretty big. This thing is turning out to be a little more massive than what I thought. But I'm, uh, I'm enjoying it. It's a lot of math, which I'm not enjoying. But I, th I think this thing is going to look awesome by the time we're done with it. With the exception of the stripes, we built up all of the walls now. I'll have to add the cone on top. I still have the basic shape down there. And I also did not build up like the bottom. I plan on digging this all out and building it up that way. But so far, so good, I'd say. Again, it doesn't have the stripes just yet, but it's definitely coming along. There's the start of the cone. There's the cone of the rocket done. And I started clearing out the surrounding island just so that I could kind of get into the area below and start filling that in, you know, like that part of the body in. And uh, then I'll go back and add the stripes. Okay, almost done with this island. Holy crap, this is... Oh my goodness, this is driving me up a wall. I just want to go on an adventure. Well, it kind of looks like a lighthouse and not much of a rocket, but there it is. It took me way too long, and holy crap, I am sick of building, but uh, we still have the inside to do. Oh boy, I can't wait. So I'm not quite done yet, but just to give you some sort of idea, we're here in the cone now. Uh, this is what I'm kind of going for. I want to add more sugar cane if possible. I don't know how yet, but I plan on doing that and then uh, going straight down into all the other machinery but we're almost there quick little status update we have all of the sugarcane now being run down i i can't really show you i should have probably done this sooner but it's being oh there we go it's being pushed through hoppers down to these two storage units and then from there it's getting pushed into these auto crafting tables to make paper there's only four in there. And then from there, it gets transferred to this storage unit. And then from that storage unit, it gets transferred to these auto crafting tables. And these are making the paper blocks. From here, all we have to do is feed them into a, an electric furnace. And then we should be good. Okay, there we go. We officially have rockets being made. That's, uh, oh boy, that's kind of, that's kind of awesome. So... We have the paper being fed down into these auto crafting tables to make the blocks. And then this specific block is being made back into paper just because I'm lazy and didn't feel like doing it. D whatever. Don't question it. And then these blocks are being pumped into a furnace, which are then being crafted into gunpowder. And then that gunpowder and the paper are being pumped into here to create rockets. And so far, we have... 45 rockets just from, you know, watching this, just working in the area. Now, however, I have a lot of extra room to play with, and I don't know if I'm going to build more of these. I just don't know yet. I might, you know, I might make a couple more smaller sugarcane farms. We'll see. But from here, my plan is, worst case, we have so much more room to play with that we could build any other machinery in here that we want. But that's going to be all for me today, guys. This, oh boy, this was a pretty extensive build. That's why towards the end here, it just got kind of sloppy. But hey, we're making rockets automatically, and that is just crazy. I love it. And there's no creepers or cats involved. It's, oh my gosh, it's such a good thing. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what else we should put in here. Should we build more rocket builders or should i put other machinery in here what do you think thank you so much and i will see you guys in the next episode